Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. And once again, I'm here. Good morning to all of you. And I hope though, that everybody will be pleased and happy. So Sahil is in here, Samir is in here, and the rest of like you know, Farooq, Gadnan, and everyone is here. So I hope that all of you will be fine and feeling good. Today, once again, I am here in, in this video. Uh, I will be discussing a proverb, okay, in English language. And as usual, I teach you some general stuff regarding English language. And after that, we will come down towards book, okay. So this is all the glitters is not gold, right? Now, what does it mean? Uh, I'm gonna tell you first of all about the pronunciation of this word glitters, okay? Some people pronounce this word gliters, which is completely wrong. And I've heard from so many educated people, they pronounce this word gli glitters, okay, with a T sound, which is also incorrect. So the correct pronunciation of this word is glitters, with a D sound. As I told you that whenever there is double T, so one T is silent, and when T is in the middle of two vowel sound, you can see here that T is in the middle of two vowel sound. So according to the rules and regulation, but remember, here I'm talking about the American accent, right? When there is double T, so when T is silent, and when T is in the middle of two vowel sound, so we pronounce with a fast D sound, not with a T sound, okay? So that is glitters. Now here, if you want to speak British English, so you will say glitter, okay? There will be no R sound, but in American English, you will say glitters. So that is all the glitter is not gold. Now what does it mean? The shining outer look of something is not a consistent sign of its real character, okay? It means that something may not be as beneficial or as valuable as it appears, okay? Now let's come down towards example and later on I will teach you its meaning in easy word in, in Pashto and Urdu word as well. So the example of this Proverb there is my father advised me that be more careful about making new friends because all the glitters is not good. It means that har chamakti hui cheez sona nahi hoti. Or you can say that agar humko koi acha lage ya ek cheez hume acha lage, dil kash lage, to zaruri nahi hai ki hakikat mein bhi wo aisi ho. So in first weekend se har surgire shagul nahi. Now I'm gonna make you another sentence by using this uh, proverb. There is I bought this wristwatch and you can see it's very expensive, it's very nice, attractive, but it stopped, now you can see it does not work, it stopped after three weeks, it means that all the glitters is not gold. Right, I'm gonna make another sentence, I, I sent my younger brother to a standard private college, but his weak result proves that all the glitters is not gold, it means that we were thinking that the college is a kind of exceptional, okay? And it will provide quality education, but actually the drama was a bit different. So all the glitters is not good mean that the attractive external appearance of something is not a reliable indication of its true nature, okay? So I hope so you have enjoyed this short clip. Now I'm gonna ask you a question. All the glitters is not good mean, what does it mean in Pashtu word? The right, this is the Apostle Pashtu. Pashtu 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 What does it mean all the glitters is not gold? Okay, so it means that don't judge a book by its cover or don't judge people by their external look. So we will say this is sufficient for today and tara for now catch you next time.